routine DUI arrest turned into a strip search, and it was all caught on camera. An Illinois woman is now suing, saying police went too far, and there was no excuse for her being treated so harshly. ABC's Gio Benitez has that story. It started out as a routine DUI arrest, but what happened after now has 33-year-old Dana Holmes at the center of a federal lawsuit, a humiliating and unwarranted strip search by LaSalle County deputies, she says. The whole thing caught on camera. Police pulled Holmes over for speeding May 18th. She allegedly told them she'd been at a wedding with her boyfriend and he was too drunk to drive. This police dash cam video shows her calmly taking a field sobriety test. Police say her blood alcohol level was about three times the legal limit. Are you going to arrest me? I am going to arrest you for DUI. She's taken to the police station, and that's where things go awry. Holmes is against the wall as the female deputy pats her down. Male deputies standing by. Then, suddenly, the officers put her on the ground. They allege she tried to kick them. I was terrified. I felt helpless. Within moments, deputies carry her into a padded room and put her face down on the floor. Then three male officers and one female remove all of her clothing, leaving her naked for two minutes until an officer tosses in some blankets. I was scared and I lay there crying. Illinois law says officers can only conduct a strip search when there is a reasonable belief that a suspect has a weapon or drugs and that they can only be searched by deputies of the same sex and that it cannot be observed by anyone not physically conducting the search. These are on-duty deputy sheriffs humiliating and groping a female inmate. And it makes you wonder, you know, were these guys ever trained? This morning, Dana Holmes says her civil rights were violated and she wants justice. I think they lose their jobs. And ABC News reached out to the county for comment, but overnight an official there told me the county won't comment on pending litigation. As for Holmes, she pleaded guilty to that DUI charge and was sentenced to probation. Robin George. All right, Gio, thank you very much. Boy, that video is something else.